so I just came back from getting my hair done um, I got all the orange out of my hair it looks a bit natural now if you can see there's a little bit of violet in my hair uh, now um, you can see it in the light I like how naturally black it looks uh, again and how they styled it but uh, yeah I have a shoot coming up in the next couple of days so I thought I could just get ready for that now so after that I um, went grocery shopping so I'm gonna show you all the things that I got so this is all that I got these are some of my favorite things as of now um, I usually whenever I go to the grocery store I tend to stock up for a couple of weeks this is not something that I um, eat like immediately um, finish it off I usually savor it so this is some um, snacks that I like I usually snack like once or twice a day um, maximum so we've got some Cheetos some Lay's Doritos um, popcorn and my favorite litchi drink so yeah this is some of the stuff that I usually snack on um, usually by the second half of the day because like in the first half I really um, fill up on food like uh, regular meals like breakfast and lunch so yeah this is just a <laughs> pass the time நினைக்கிறேன் <laughs> 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 பின்னாடி <laughs> 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 பண்ணிட்டு 
so I just got back home from sh filming our car vlog um, we had a lot of fun uh, we talked about a lot of things um, literally just preparing for it took so many hours um, getting all the equipment ready um, and uh, wearing all our mics checking all the audio and getting all the camera set up um, and uh, once we figured everything out, everything went smoothly. Yes, the setup took a long time, but then the output came out really well. I'm sure you'll enjoy it. Um, so yeah, now I'm gonna prepare for uh, tonight's live. I'm going live on Family Channel, um, doing a Tamil live, and I'll be preparing for it right now. I already um, have a few points uh, ready that I want to talk about so I'll be going over it uh, get, uh, preparing a few verses and um, um, just meditating um, on it and uh, praying and uh, um, yeah so I'll probably have my dinner as well during this time and uh, finally uh, get ready to go live so <laughs> stick around to see uh, what's coming next So since the last hair care video, a lot of you have been requesting that I show you how I take care of my natural curls, what products that I use, and um, also my after shower hair care routine. So I wanted to show you because a lot of you also have my hair texture which is wavy. Um, so um, I wanted to inspire you um, with how I take care of my hair. So this is a routine that I actually started building. Um, during the first lockdown in 2020 so after that I learned how to tame my hair and what works for me what doesn't what makes it frizzy what makes it calm down and what uh, accentuates my curls so that I don't have to use uh, hot tools anymore or, or less um, comparatively and uh, keep it natural as much as possible so that it's safe for my hair and also use nourishing products that um, keep it nice and healthy. In the shower, I use three main products. So I use a shampoo, which is this one. Um, I've been loving using this. It's the Moroccan oil hydrating shampoo. So um, it's very good because it doesn't have any sulfates, phosphates, parabens, um, which are really like damaging to your hair in the long run. Um, it's very not, not good for your hair. Um, so since it's uh, free of all of that, it's good for my um, curly, wavy hair. And also it's color safe because I tend to color it every few months and so I want the color to stay in my hair as much as possible. That's what I typically use and if I find a lot of buildup in my hair or dandruff or anything that's clogging my scalp, um, making it itchy and gross, um, I tend to use this shampoo which is really good to clear all of that buildup up. So this is the Natural Tech Purifying Shampoo. This is something that I picked up recently um, and I really like using this one. Yeah, this is also um, free of all the parabens and sulfates and everything so it's safe to use as well. After shampooing my hair, I tend to wear a hair mask. I've been using the Shea Moisture Deep Treatment Mask. I love this one because um, of all the good ingredients that it has. So it's very nourishing, very like thick um, and it says it's for dry and damaged hair and has sea kelp and argan oil and all of that so it helps healing my hair, growing my hair and strengthening my hair and I really love how it feels and the results that I've gotten after using it. I tend to leave it in for like about 5-10 to 10 minutes um, and then after that I rinse it off and go ahead with my conditioner. So this one I've been using for a long 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 time. I really love the smell of it and also it has um, nourishing oils so this is the Aussie 3 minute miracle conditioner. I love using this one. I leave it in for a minute or two and then I rinse it out. So after that, I come out of the shower. I usually wrap my hair with a towel. So this one is the towel that I use. It's like very basic cotton towel that we get at, uh, at the store. 
um, so I use that and after coming out it looks like this it's pretty it's like starting to dry now but the best thing to do is when you are applying after shower products like curl cream or gel or mousse or anything you want it to be very like soaking wet so that the product absorbs into your hair and you get to keep that nice texture that you already have it doesn't get frizzy so now since my hair is um, like my bangs and everything is sort of like dry I want to wet it again I have this little spray that I got off of Amazon and I put some water in it now I'm going to wet my hair so wherever I'm gonna apply the product I want those areas to be wet so I'm not going near the roots or anything but like the mids of my hair and then working it down especially the bottom parts of the strands I want it to be nice and wet so now that my hair is nice and wet I'm gonna start applying my curl cream the product called curl up it's a curling cream um, it's by an Indian brand so which is pretty cool it's for frizzy wavy and curly hair which is definitely mine I go through my hair with my fingers um, I use one hand for one portion of my hair split it into two sections and then just go through my hair with this product all over the place wherever I know it's gonna get frizzy so like the tops of my head like here not going too much into my scalp but just like coating um, the strands of my hair so I have coated um, every single strand with the product and yeah the last thing that I do is scrunch those waves upwards just with my hand and after that I section it and clip off my bangs and just let it rest until it dries completely I don't touch it I don't play with it I don't do anything to it I just leave it as it is so that it forms into whatever curl pattern it wants to and uh, yeah it just settles and dries on its own um, so if you feel like this is too wet for you you can also use a towel or a t-shirt an old t-shirt and then just scrunch it up in the same way with it um, so that it soaks up the water but don't do it too much or else it'll like destroy the curl part making it frizzy so I will check in with you later to show you how it looks like after it's dry so it's the morning after I wash my hair and uh, let it set and dry and uh, this is the final result of my hair so I love how my waves look um, this is my natural texture and I enhanced it a little bit by just scrunching it up um, you know with the curl cream and uh, letting it set so usually it sets like this for the whole week and um, yeah I really lo love how it turned out it's just to encourage you to spend more time taking care of your hair, learning what your hair texture is and how to um, take care of it the best way that you can. Um, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. This is just a week in my life. Um, what goes on during my day, what I do when I go out and how I shoot my videos and things like that. So I hope you enjoyed looking at a glimpse into my life. Subscribe to this channel if you want more videos like this and hit that bell icon to get notified every time I upload a video. Don't forget to like and comment below and I'll see you next time. Bye!